What is going on guys, TVM here, welcome to some more sniping filters. This works on PlayStation and Xbox and probably PC as well, why not? Uh, so we're going to start off with two reasonably cheap ones with basically so those of you who without any coins can do. Um, you're going to need in and around 700 minimum, but if you do want to pick up some really good deals then 2 to 3k for the first two. So this, the filters are uh, quality gold, uh, centre back, Brazil, French League 1, Paris Saint-Germain, I think you know where I'm going with this. 3,300 on Xbox currently, click search, and then you get yourself two Marquinhos's. But, of course, as you know, there are quite a few Brazilian centre-backs that play for Paris Saint-Germain. We have Marquinhos, we have uh, David Luiz, and we have Thiago Silva. So, again, the easiest thing to do, press Y, press B, come back and have a look. One has been listed for 3-3, so you know that it's instant and that it works straight away. Unfortunately, it's not a deal we can pick up. You do get an awful lot of Marquinhos's listed up for... Uh, I would, I, I'd love to say, oh, you know, get loads for discard, or loads go up for 700 coins, but unfortunately, that's not the case. Um, uh, this sniping malarkey is kind of not running down and not losing its charm, essentially, but a lot of people are cottoning onto it now, and a lot of people are making less mistakes, if that makes any sense. But you do get the odd person who likes to list up for much less than what they're going for. So if someone's just ripping through packs, they want to list up for... Um, you know, just to get out of the club really, really quickly so it doesn't take transfer list space, then you do get people listing them up for about 2k. I've seen quite a few go for 2,000. I've not been quick enough to grab them myself. I'm actually on the wrong account. I'm doing something for a series, and I thought I'd just jump on and make this video very, very quickly. Uh, but that's basically what you're looking for. I have seen a few David Luises go up for discard. Again, not quick enough to get them. Haven't seen any Thiago Silvers as of yet, but it is a possibility. So as we go and look for the next one, I'm going to run through uh, the reason why sniping filters actually work a lot. A lot of people have been saying to me, hey, I don't even understand what you're doing with this sniper filter in Malarkey. It doesn't make any sense to me. Well, basically, as we search up for Premier League uh, Colombian forwards, because again, there are only a couple, um, Victor Ibarbo and Radamal Falcao. Falcao obviously goes for a few thousand, but uh, Victor Ibarbo, 2007, he will have gone by the time I go back, more than likely. There he is, he's gone already. Um, so again, a very, very good method if you want to pick up players on the cheap, if you want to build a squad. But it's also very good for trading as well, for obvious reasons. This is why we're doing the video in the first place, is for trading. You will get an awful lot of deals going up at, uh, at a, a decent rate. Especially if you do this at prime time. It's currently like ridiculous o'clock in the morning for me right now. It is a... Uh, let me look at the clock. It's 2.53am uh, as I'm recording this, right? So obviously not a lot of people play in Ultimate Team at the moment. So if you do this at prime time as I keep spouting out oh well a right a a i haven't got enough coins but b that is what i'm talking about radamal falca i'm two coins away i probably would have been able to get him i panicked because i had to look at my coins but basically there you go that's what you're looking for right falca right there 750 coins if we go in and back again he will definitely be gone yep he's definitely gone right now i'm gonna have a look to see how much falca is because that my friends is something that i was hoping to catch um, basically proof that this works. If I had enough coins, I may have been able to, to nab him. Uh, so we're going to have a look to see how much he goes for. There you go. He sells for, what, 8,000 8, coins, something along those lines. And he was just listed up for 750. Basically, what happens is you'll buy a player or get a player in a pack and you'll have a look at him. And instead of clicking compare price, you click list on the market. And the way that EA have done it this year is you'll start off at his minimum price and he'll automatically, his, his buy now will automatically be set to like one setting above that. So say his minimum is 700 coins, his maximum will be 750. And people, instead of clicking compare price, will accidentally click list. And that's exactly what happened there. I've seen people do it with informs on stream accidentally. I've seen people do it with various different things. So there you go. That's, that's one that definitely works. Let's go have a look at another one. And we're going to go to, uh, we're going to go to Spain for this one. Uh, we're going to go all the way down here. I've gone the wrong way, but uh, we're going to go to Real Madrid. And we're going to have a look at... We're going to get rid of this. We don't need any forwards or anything. You've got to go for gold. Basically, there is a bronze player um, that you obviously want to try and avoid because we're going to try and just look at the gold players because obviously those are the ones that are going to be worth money. Uh, Rafael Varane and Karim Benzema is what you're looking for. I've got no idea how much Varane goes for these days. I think he's probably in and around, in and around this amount here. Okay, he's going up, is he? Okay, going up a lot by the looks of things. There you go. Okay, Raphael, Raphael Varane is a lot more expensive than what he used to be. Uh, but anyway, basically, again, what you're going to be doing is going back and forth, back and forth. You will get the odd Benzema, but I've, I've only ever seen one, and he wasn't listed for, like, discard value. 
um, I was widening the search for uh, the price filters up and down a bit just to just in case basically what you want to do again is you can look for people accidentally listing them for discard or you can go in here and you can lift this up to say 18,000 for instance to try and nab yourself a cheap current Benzema you can do it with um, if you really want to go and like just do Benzema for instance you can just search up for Benzema or put it onto forward so you just get rid of all the Raphael Varans. but if you go all the way over to forward over here it takes a while to get to the 59th minute but um, obviously if you do it sensibly and you don't rush there EA won't ban you off the market because it thinks you're a bot but if you just casually go over you know letting the page load and then skipping over getting to the 59th here if then what you want to do see there's one there for 13,000 that's just been listed I mean I don't know if that's I don't think that's good but anyway press Y go back again and then check to the card to the right, you may be lucky enough to grab yourself either a cheap Varane or a Karim Benzema. What you ideally want, there you go, what you ideally want is for there to be a card to the right that is an hour plus, so that you don't have to skip over for the page, because if you are skipping over for the page, it does waste time, but um, that's what you're looking for, really. But again, Varane, Benzema, those are decent ones to look for. Um, the last one is actually going to be one that I've seen other people do, unfortunately. It's one that um, we, we talked about um, Robert Lewandowski before um, being able to convert him down to a, um, to a cam and actually sell him on. Someone said that they did it. It took a while, but they did actually eventually sell him. Uh, again, just proving that these methods do indeed work. But what you're going to be looking for is either Thomas Muller or Robert Lewandowski. Now, again, Thomas Muller was cheaper earlier, but he's gone back up to what, uh, 29k-ish. Yeah, he was about 26,000 earlier when I was doing this. 28,750, okay? So again, you're gonna click Y, you're gonna go back, you can have a look, and again, you're gonna hope that people are gonna accidentally list up uh, their Robert, you're, you're basically looking for Robert Lewandowski in this situation. They've already sold, that is crazy. Uh, so you are looking for Robert Lewandowski, hopefully someone accidentally lists one up and you can nab him, but you are looking for people doing it for Muller as well. And again, another thing you're looking for is people listing up Muller slightly cheaper uh, than what he is going for on the market. So 29k, if you are looking to build a squad, again, keep doing this and you could probably nab him for about 27 if you... If you've got some patience, you save yourself 2,000 coins. Do that on every player. You're going to save quite a lot of money there, really, if you think about it. Uh, but if you are looking to trade, obviously, you're going to be looking for something along the lines of about 26, 27,000 minimum, or maximum, I should say. Uh, but those are pretty much the the sniping filters. I'm pretty annoyed about that file cut. If I had two more, literally two coins on this account, I'm on the wrong account, as I said, but if I had two extra coins, I may have been able to nab him. I know that I cocked it up when I went to buy him. The reason I cocked it up is because I didn't have enough coins to bid. Um, otherwise, I would have been able to, you know, go on the buy now thing. But th that's basically it. Um, keep doing that. Uh, the cheaper ones for me work better. The Falcao, uh, the, the, the Colombian one, and the other one that I showed you as well, the, the cheapy ones, they work better than the big ones because people with like Robert, Robert Lewandowski, for instance, will take a lot more care with their with their players, so they won't necessarily rush to to list them or to compare price. They'll just sort of be casual with it. But uh, there we are. Um, unfortunately, we didn't manage to nab him. Let me know in the comment section what's your best snipe in the last week. I'd be very interested to know if you've enjoyed it. Do me a favor, smack the like button, subscribe to your channel. Thank you very much for watching, and as always, till the next time, goodbye. UFIFA.com are now selling FIFA points 60% cheaper than retail. If you use the code TVM, you get yourself 8% discount as well. The link is in the description.